Serbia set a course for European integration in the early 2000s after the fall of Slobodan Milosevic's regime. However, compared to its neighbors Croatia, Bulgaria and Romania, it has failed to do so over such a long period of time. Experts note the role of Moscow's influence in slowing down the country's European integration. For a long time, Serbia was dependent on cheap Russian energy resources and diplomatic support in terms of not recognition. Recognizing Kosovo. Analysts also point to Russia's role in fueling ethnic conflicts in the Balkans, which has become a barrier to European integration for many countries in the region. Russia will use these ethical issues to create conflict and to destabilize the situation there, because when people don't think about their development or making money, and instead they think about the fact that their neighbor is of different nationality and has something against them, it's an opportunity to make these people quarrel and fight among themselves. And of course, it's important for Ukraine because a stable Balkans means that it's not going to distract Europe from the problems that exist in Ukraine. According to experts, after the fall of Russia's authority in the international arena due to the war with Ukraine, the Serbian leadership stopped seeing the sense in deepening cooperation with Russia, not considering it an influential partner. Despite the jump in trade turnover between Serbia and Russia in 2022, the country managed to replace imports from Russia with European goods in two years. Belgrade has also started to confirm more openly that Serbian weapons get to Ukraine through third countries. But as analysts say, this course of the country's leadership will continue very slowly, as pro-Russian sentiments are very significant among Serbian citizens. Serbian society in its majority is full of Russian propaganda. They believe in separate Russian orthodoxy and that Putin will protect them. And this will continue to be the case there. If the president pretends that he is turning towards Towards the European Union, there will always be a threat that Russian agents, the Russian spy network, will become active and will once again fuel some kind of protests against the government. Apart from Russia, there are several other obstacles to Serbia's European integration. The country's economic indicators and standard of living are lagging behind even in comparison with not very rich EU members Bulgaria and Romania. In addition, Serbia's freedom of speech and democracy indicators have deteriorated. However, experts say that the recently signed mining agreement with the European Union by President Aleksandar Vucic, which allows Serbia to import large amounts of lithium to the EU could be the key to the country's European integration. The difference between European countries that are in the EU and those that are outside the Union is absolutely drastic. No country outside the EU can afford the price of reforms, so it should be sponsored only by the European Union, the reforms that can bring the country closer to the EU. Vucic wants to use this new issue of lithium mining and production of electronic cars in his favor and thus get larger funds for structural reforms. The issue of Kosovo is an obstacle to Serbia's European integration, despite the fact that Brussels has made its recognition a condition for European integration, Belgrade absolutely refuses to do so. Since Kosovo also aspires to join the EU, experts believe that the integration of the entire Western Balkan region into the Union will help to erase borders between the countries and resolve many ethnic disputes. Reported by Sergei Kulas, Andrei Dmitry. Ranko, UATV News.